I saw him for the first time at a beachside Panera's in Florida. Kitted out in rubber waders, a well-used coat, sunglasses, and sporting a scruffy beard, it would be an understatement to say that he was unremarkable. He was a regular like me, and we would sometimes nod in greeting or say good morning. When I would leave after about an hour, he would usually still be sitting at his table. If he did leave before me, the direction that he headed in was clearly not towards the parking lot. So was he a homeless guy, maybe a war vet or someone down on his luck? Some time passed and suddenly I didn't see him anymore. He faded from memory as most of these kinds of casual encounters do. And then one day at another Panera is nowhere near the first one. There he was again. Same rubber waders as though he were about to go fishing, well-worn coat, scruffy beard, and sunglasses. Nice to see you, he said as he passed my table. A little random connection of one human being with another where the prospects are endless, but the risks too great to attempt to further deepen the association. The daily early morning visits to Panera continued for some time, and then suddenly, one day, he was gone again. I've often thought about him and wondered about his history on this journey through life that we all follow. So for this reason, I'm dedicating this short video to him. Hopefully he's a good guy on his way to another Panera's somewhere en route to wherever he's headed. Maybe he is indeed a fisherman with those uncomfortable looking waders that he walks around in. Or maybe he's a fugitive running from a broken relationship or the law. Or maybe he just likes the coffee at Panera's. Whatever the story, there was certainly something about him. Wishing you safe travels, sir, and lots of good hot coffee to speed you on your way.